YouTube, what's going on YouTube? What is going on? What is happening, man? Of course, it's your guy. One more time, Deidre Alex Jr. And I'm back with another fragrance video. Smell good family. Hopefully everyone is doing well, doing great, doing fantastic. Positive energy, positive vibes. Y'all know how we rock out here on this channel, man. Positive vibes only, all right? So, um, this video has been requested for quite some time. So it's a, it's a tie-in for me, a uh, personal tie-in. Um, just a quick story. All right, so I've been on a, I'm a bigger dude. <laughs> All right, I'm a bigger guy. So I've been on a weight loss journey pretty much my whole life. Well, probably about 10 years ago, um, I lost up to 100 pounds in uh, one year leading up to my wedding. All right, so um, I still, you know, I'm a bigger dude, just naturally bigger build. Um, but I've been I've been doing well, keeping myself together since that incredible, uh, hard and tough weight loss journey, which required me to eat a lot better. And then, of course, working out. So how does this tie into today's video? Well, I've been getting requests of D. What are some fragrances that I can wear to the gym? What are some fragrances that I can wear working out? Go walking. What well, play basketball? I, I literally get these um question so i said you know what let's go ahead and piece a video together i haven't done one of these in a while i think the last time i did a video like this was probably two years ago maybe but today i have eight eight fragrance recommendations for the athletic man the athletic person some of these are unisex way but we're going to stick with um the athletic man all right so these are just some of my personal favorites to wear to the gym i know we you know there's a you know, people love to categorize things, which you can and cannot wear. I probably contribute to that with my seasonal and situational fragrance talk. Um, but again, these are fragrances that I just like to wear to the gym. Now, for anyone out there saying, wow, wearing fragrances to the gym, hear me out. You're going to the gym to work out, yes. You're not going to the gym, you know, to smell just absolutely god awful in the worst way possible, are we? Well, I'm not. All right. I go and I do my thing. I work out and I still have a nice scent going around your boy. Maybe that's just a thing in Fragcom. I don't know. But that's what I do. And I'm sure some of you watching, y'all do the same thing or not. All right. But let's go ahead and dive into it. I have eight recommendations right here um, that I personally wear to the gym. All right. Up first, from the House of Eve, Saint Laurent. All right, we have Wild Sale Y O Fresh. Wild Sale Y S L Y O Fresh. Now, this is a discontinued fragrance. As you can see, a massive dent in that bottle. Luckily for me, I have a backup bottle on deck when this wears out. Now, normally, this is one of my favorite summer scents. You'll probably see this in my summer top 10 when that releases, but it's something about that lemon and that ginger combo. There's like a, a, a cooling ice feel to this fragrance as well. It's just two sprays for me. I don't do six to seven. No, we got two sprays behind the ears and we're going to the gym. I don't usually spray anything on my clothes. Uh, like I'm wearing like a t-shirt and I'm going, um, I'm working inside the gym, maybe doing some kickboxing or some boxing, or we're just, you know, maybe doing a cycling class. I might spray one to the chest, a personal spray so I could uh, benefit. But anyway, this is just great, fresh, clean, has a little bit of a spice to it. Um, two sprays and you're gonna be good to go. I've been complimented in the gym on this fragrance. I don't go to the gym to get complimented. I go to the gym to work out, do my thing, play some ball or whatever I got going on. But this has, for those who care, who those who want, compliments this has gotten me a compliment or two hard to find i think i see 50 mls out there floating around on ebay and, and places like that don't so spend over 200 plus dollars on that but do what you will with your money shout out to my man eq i am not your financial advisor all right but this is one of the ones i love to wear to the gym from the house of eve saint laurent we have why sell wise oh fresh oh fresh dope bottle too might be my favorite from the line i don't know all right up next from the house of Versace, clean and fresh. That's it. We have Versace Pour On. Versace Pour On. This is very simple, clean and fresh. Beautiful clean musk, light floor presentation. 
smells like you're just fresh out of the shower. That's what it smells like. And again, two sprays behind each ear, maybe one for good luck to the middle of my chest, and then we're going to the gym. This is one that I wore quite a bit over the last year to the gym. I used to wear this all the time. I used to wear this to the office. I don't wear it that much anymore to the office because I found other things that kind of suit me a little bit better. Not to say nothing wrong with this because there's nothing wrong with it at all, but to the gym is where I find this to be most beneficial. All right, so a couple sprays of this, clean and fresh. It might even go unnoticeable um, unless you go crazy with sprays, which I don't recommend going to the gym and doing, but this is something that is uh, really clean and really good and not gonna offend anybody. And if you just need kind of like a mood lifter for yourself while you're getting your workout in, this could provide that, all right? You can find us on discounts for a great price. Um, and it's again, simply clean and fresh. From the house of Versace, we have Versace Pour All. Great for the gym, great for the gym. All right, up next, we're gonna talk about a fragrance that I see no conversation about ever again, and maybe because it may be discontinued. I, I think that it is. I just seen some bottles of this the other day, so I, I don't know, don't quote me. But this is one that gets lost in its line, but it's really good to me, especially for the gym. From the house of Avogadon, we have Lom Adial Sport. Lom Adial Sport, that's right, you don't see this bottle like that, that blue edge bottle, that blue top, clean bottle. So take your girl on Lom Adial DNA, take it, all right? And you get, uh, you add some watery notes, you add some white florals, there's a Neroli in here, I believe. Um, you still get that uh, almond powderiness in here, like, and, and, and it's it's really smooth. It's, it's, I don't know if it's sandalwood in here or not, but it's a really smooth tone to this fragrance. Very easy to wear. A lot of people are kind of like, uh, this smells weird due to the, um, the combination of the almond and then the watery notes and the white floral. It doesn't smell like an everyday, this is a rather unique scent uh, in, anyway, but to the gym, it just works. Cause again, it comes off very clean, very fresh and very smooth. Again, another two sprays right behind each ear and then we are moving, all right? So this is one that doesn't get talked about a lot, maybe because it is discontinued. Again, don't quote me, but this is a great option for myself. These are, I wear these. These are eight that I wear. I'm recommending them for sure. From the house of Girlon, we have Lom Adial Sport. And it's in the name, Sport, all right, there we go. All right, up next, man, this is just one of my favorite fragrances to wear, period. Uh, not even just in the gym, especially during the summertime, man. This is a great easy wear. It's good stuff. From the house of Hugo Boss, we have Hugo Boss Reversed. The, the, the beautiful citrus bergamot opening and that soapy clean vetiver, man, it just works. Very, very soapy vetiver. I wouldn't say this is like super masculine. No, the vetiver just doesn't do that. It provides a cleanliness to this, soapiness to this fragrance. The bergamot, citrus in here, kind of gives it a little sparkly feel. So this is a feel good scent, all right? Especially when you're on one of those grueling leg days or chest days, or just one of those grueling workouts, man. It just depends on where you are with your uh, training throughout the week. This is just one that could kind of elevate you know what i'm saying your mood and and keep you going because it does smell really good when you're working out it's no science here you, you, your body temperature heats up you're sweating sweating your pores are opening up so these fragrances will have a tendency to just kind of you know really show out so to speak that's why a lot of sprays are not recommended just a couple behind each ear and we're good to go but from the house of hugo boss we have hugo boss reverse big fan of that soapy vetiver cleanliness with that sparkle uh, from that bergamot citrus for sure. All right, up next, a new one to the collection. I've worn this to the gym twice, um, and I'm gonna wear this outside of the gym, but I've been wanting to wear it. So from the house of Zoa Aroma, all right, we have Napoleon Cologne. Napoleon Cologne, oh, it's kind of hard to see that clash with my studio light. But this is a really good take on Creed Aventus Cologne, okay? Much more fresher version, instead of that pineapple-y, uh, citrusy feel, well, well, it is a citrus in here, you get this orange, this orange citrus instead. It has some um, uh, some really bright spots when it comes to the freshness of this fragrance, but overall, you're gonna get that 
uh, that orange citrus. You're going to get a little bit of musk. Um, there's not really much bite to it, um, but there's a minty. Uh, there's a birch in here as well. So it just works. So a couple sprays behind each ear and we're good to go. This really performs really well. EDP concentration, Zoro Aroma has some great deals, um, some great uh, fragrances for a great price. And this is just one that said, hey, I, I'm itching to wear this. I don't know if I can wait to summer, so I'm gonna give this a spin in the gym. And it worked out. And I think I'm gonna keep wearing it to the gym um, because it's a good option. From the House of Zoro Aroma, we have Napoleon Cologne. Really good stuff. Very good stuff, for sure. All right, up next, uh, one from the House of Polo. I used to wear this all the time uh, when I first got it, like during the summer, going out and about. This was my fragrance of choice. But then it turned to a gym scent. Probably got it probably about a year ago because I, I just haven't been wearing it to work and stuff like that. Not that they say it's not good there, but there's other options for me um, that I've been wearing. But from the house of Polo, excuse me, from the house of Robin Warren, we got Polo Blue, Deep Blue Parfum. Deep Blue Parfum. Beautiful mango citrus. Opening with this, you still get your, your aquatic feel, kind of like a salty aquatic with this thing. Uh, there's a little bit of a, uh, um, um, uh, like a green touch to it. It's an undertone up underneath the citruses. There's a beautiful mango note in here as well, but it really is uh, an aquatic feel. So again, qualifies for something to wear to the gym. All right, I, I wear this a lot when I play basketball um, because I had, I'm not superstitious, <laughs> but for a little while, um, I, was, I, was, I was a bucket. I was getting buckets wearing this uh, to play ball. And again, two sprays behind each ear. Um, some weirder compliments, you know, when you're playing basketball, you got somebody in the post, you know, you're trying to do your thing and they say, bro, you smell great. And you're like, what? And somebody steals the ball and goes all the way for the layup for the compliment. <laughs> that has actually happened. My teammates are going to be like, bro, what's up? You know, but it just kind of catches you off guard, man. But this one is a really good choice. I really like it. Like I said, I've been playing, uh, when I play basketball, this is just one I have gravitated towards. It's brought me some good luck. So that's really why I've still be wearing to the gym i'll still wear it during the summer but to the gym is a great choice from the house of ralph Lauren, we have polos polo blue d blue parfum parfum good stuff all right two more left to discuss and this right here is my absolute favorite to wear to the gym this is the number one gym fragrance that i am wearing right now the last probably week that i've been to the gym i wore this from the house of Dasi Air. All right, we have, uh, excuse me, Aromatic Ginger. Big time clash with my studio light, I'm sure, but Aromatic Ginger. This is a clone of Louis Vuitton's Lemensity, I believe that's how it's pronounced. And this is awesome. Ginger, grapefruit, aquatic notes. There's a uh, some mint here, um, but big, spicy ginger and tarty, fruity grapefruit that's what you get two one time i got carried away with this it was just smelling so good on the weekends when i'm off from work i go to the gym real early all right so we're up 7 a.m trying to get to the gym 7 30 8 o'clock and i must have sprayed on a few sprays and i walked into the gym and walking past the uh, pro shop <laughs> the gentleman goes my man's where are we going when we leave the gym <laughs> so he kind of had like an accent that's what he said. I like, damn, bro, you can smell way over there. Said, oh, yeah, well, you came in the door. So I'm, I'm assuming my siage, or when I closed the door shut behind me, the wind came and, 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 and touched and blessed my man's nose. So I said, okay, we might want to dive us back to one spray, but I didn't. So we went to the back of the head and then one to the chest, and we still left it there. So I haven't had anything since. I did have a compliment when I was riding, not riding, when I was on the Stairmaster. Uh, the lady next to me uh, complimented me. She said, oh, you, you smell real good. And I said, I appreciate that. So I could tell she was kind of stumped, like, wow, he's smelling like that in the gym? So I don't know. It, like I said, it, it's going to seem weird to some, but to you and to me, it's not. But my favorite to wear to the gym right now, I don't own them in today. This is my only clone or my only, I, I have a, um, decan of them in today, but other than that, this has been my lone experience uh, wearing the DNA and uh, Dossier did a great job for sure. All right, so from the house of Dossier, we have our aromatic ginger to the gym. Two sprays, two sprays, everything. And last but not least, 
This is an excellent rendition of a fragrance that's very popular, been popular in the community. Um, and it probably will continue to be, especially during the summertime. But this is their rendition and it's really good. From the House of Armoff, we have Aurora Fresh. Oh, fresh from the house of Armoff. Now, this is a clone of Versace's, I don't forgot the name of it already, uh, Versace's Main Old Fresh. <laughs> Versace's Main Old Fresh. Beautiful star fruit note and musk, a little bit of spice to it, but this is an EDP concentration. The original uh, Mano Fresh is not. Um, it is an EDT. But honestly, this one is not as tart and ripe as the Star It comes off as a Star Fruit in the original, the Mano Fresh. This one comes off a lot more smoother. Honestly, it's easier to wear. It's great priced at $23, $25. I got a shout out my man Ross. He's talked about this last year, I believe, last summer. And I was on the hunt to get it because I had Mano Fresh. Um, but it was something about it that I, I wanted to, I was some, the way he discussed it or described it, it intrigued me uh, of the smoother take on it. So that's why I copped it. And I'm glad that I did. And this is an excellent wear. I'm talking about on those hot, hot days when I don't make it to the gym, maybe doing some calisthenics, maybe we're taking a jog, maybe we're playing basketball outside. This is the one I normally gravitate towards because that star fruit and that musk and a slight fresh spicy pop is really, really good. From the house of Armoff, Great clone of Versace Mano Fresh. I really enjoy it. Get it for a great price on discounts for sure. We have Aurora Fresh. Aurora Fresh. All right. All right, Smilga family. So those are my eight recommendations and the actual eight fragrances that I wear um, to the gym. This is what I wear to the gym. And yes, you can smell good by going to the gym and getting your workout in. And I'm encouraging anybody out there who's trying to work out and better themselves. I'm still on the journey. I have my struggles. I've lost a lot of weight. Like I said, still a bigger guy. It's in the kitchen, it's a struggle sometimes. Working out can be a struggle, but the focus and everything starts up here. So uh, good luck to everybody on their journey. Uh, but this video has been requested, so I decided to go ahead and come through, all right? And uh, hopefully you guys enjoy these eight. Of course, Mugger family, give your recommendations down below. Um, give me some workout tips as well, uh, what you got going on. I'm just, I'm not really trying to be skinny like that. I'm trying to keep my build you know be sleek you know what I'm saying keep it going you know what I'm saying okay we ain't, I ain't uh, all right we good all right till next time y'all splack up splack it down splack that thing all around remember what you put out into this world is exactly what you are going to get back appreciate y'all positive energy positive vibes till next time splack it.